Hey guys, my name is Deanna Herve and welcome or welcome back. So today I'm going to be doing a review on the line G Natural. It is a black owned brand that makes all natural curly hair products. So I'm going to review that today for you guys on my channel. So just stay tuned so you can see how G Naturals worked for me. I already shampooed my hair so now I'm going to go in with their mint conditioner and I'm going to pair it with their hair growth oil so I can make it into a deep conditioner. I'm going to section off my hair, make sure that it's soaking wet while I'm applying the conditioner and I'm also going to make sure that I put the conditioner onto my scalp. It has mint in it and it has other ingredients in it that help to soothe and cool your scalp if you have any type of scalp irritation, if you're prone to dandruff or if your scalp is dry then this helps your scalp as well so after I work it through my hair I like to massage it into my scalp as well It's been about a week and a half since I washed my hair. My scalp was a little dry, so this conditioner really helped a lot with that. It was very soothing, it was very cooling, it was very refreshing. I loved the way that it felt on my scalp. I really liked the mint conditioner alongside the hair growth oil. It worked great as a deep conditioner. It made my hair feel soft. I feel like it gave my hair great shine and the moisture was, it was just there once I locked the moisture in with the hair growth oil. So I'm just applying the conditioner all over my head obviously, then I'm going to massage it into my scalp. Then I like to leave it in for about 20 to 25 minutes. And then I'm going to start my wash and go process. So with all my wash and goes, I like to make sure my hair is soaking wet, as wet as I can get it. I'm going in with the spray leave-in conditioner first, and then using the hair pudding after the spray leave-in. I'm just going to do that all over my head. I'm not going to talk through it all just because you guys can see what I'm doing and see how the product is working in my hair. So I lied, I got something else to say. The spray leave-ins are really difficult for me because my hair is so thick. It's really hard to saturate my hair with it. So any dry spots that I see, I just go back in with it and try to saturate that section with the spray leave-in. But yeah, I always have a hard time with spray leave-in conditioners. It's not just one brand in particular. It's just my hair is super thick and my hair likes lotion types of leave-ins. The Honey Glaze Hair Pudding is so thick and so creamy and very moisturizing so it kind of made up for the leave-in conditioner but I just work that into my hair making sure my hair is soaking wet and I try to work in small sections just to make sure that each section is saturated with the Honey Glaze Hair Pudding. I was a little more generous with the honey glaze hair pudding just because I'm not using a gel. I'm not using a gel just so I can see how the products really work. And you can see my hair is very moisturized from the honey glaze hair pudding. But with a gel, gel just makes the style last longer for me. That's something I'm definitely going to incorporate next time I use the honey glaze hair pudding. But for this wash and go so I can see how it works and I can show you guys how it works. I'm not using a styler or a gel. I'm going to go all over my head with the honey glaze hair pudding and the spray leave-in conditioner just like I did in the first section. Nothing new here with that. I'm sorry that I'm whispering guys. It's 12 a.m. I am tired. My kids and my fiance are sleeping so I'm trying to whisper but I wanted to get this video out for you guys as soon as possible. So yeah, dedication.
these are my results the next day. I didn't separate or fluff my curls or anything. I'm gonna take the hair growth oil and separate my hair. So this is how my hair looks after using all the G Natural products. That I am really shocked at how well this brand did in my hair. When you don't hear of a brand and you don't see them like in the big box stores, you might automatically assume that it might not be good or it might not work. But this stuff is really, really moisturizing. I am so happy with how this wash and go turned out. I didn't use any gel with it, so I see some frizz, which is expected when you just use a leave-in and a styling cream, for me at least. But I know if I use a gel alongside this stuff, my wash and goes are going to look so good just because of this hair pudding. And if you are going to try anything, I really do recommend trying this and trying the hair growth oil. The hair growth oil really complemented the conditioner really well. I know any conditioner that I put this with is going to complement really well. So I definitely recommend this and the hair pudding. If you had to choose between the two, I do recommend the hair pudding. Just because it's so moisturizing, it smells so good, a little bit goes a long way. Be Natural is a black owned brand. I reached out to them because I wanted to try their stuff and they sent me a big package with a bunch of stuff in it. I'll link all the information for G Natural down below. Definitely recommend giving it a try. I did love this mint conditioner. It did feel really soothing and it did give my scalp a cool feeling. I think it really did help with itching and flaking, which it claims to do. It claims to help eliminate scalp irritation, itching, flaking, and dryness while increasing blood circulation to promote a healthier scalp. Honestly, like I really recommend the whole line. I recommend the conditioner, the hair growth oil, and of course, this honey hair pudding. The leave-in conditioner, I'll do without just because it's a spray. Sprays are always hard for me to spray on my hair because my hands are usually soaking wet. I feel like I have to spray a lot of it to really penetrate and saturate my hair in it. Spray leave-in conditioners in general. I feel like they just don't go a long way for me. This one was really good. It did feel really moisturizing. I just don't do spray leave-in conditioners. But if you buy this one, you won't be disappointed. You guys definitely need to try G Naturals. I'm going to put all the information down below. I promise my opinion is not biased. I was not paid for this video. I tried their products because it's a black owned all natural brand. They do have all natural ingredients. And I tried it and I'm so happy. Sorry, my son was trying to run off of my oil. But I'm so happy that I tried this brand. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys tried G Naturals. If you do try it, let me know how it works out for you. And I will see you in the next upload. Bye-bye.